you got a result. Look at your life. Ask people. My companionship inventory with my wife consists of three questions. How many questions? Three. 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 Thank you. It's what can I do better? What am I doing wrong? And what's one thing that I'm doing good? Two of the questions are designed to help me. I don't need people telling me, so tell me, you're so good, you're so awesome. I do need that sometimes. The thing that helps me grow is the awareness. The what? Awareness. Awareness, awareness okay? So when you become aware, like keenly aware of like a problem. If I'm walking out of the house and I got a big hole in my pants, and I'm like, yeah, I'm looking good. My wife's like, oh, uh, go change your pants. Why? Because there's a hole. Oh, now I'm aware, now I can go change. It's these blind spots, these what? Blind, blind spots. spots. Blind spots that we hear, see, and experience, experience throughout our whole life that programs a paradigm, a what? Paradigm. paradigm. Into us. And if the map is wrong, we only get faster to the wrong place <laughs> every single day. So we want to change the beliefs, change the what? Beliefs. Now, one, we become aware. Number two is understand. <laughs> understanding. What I mean by understanding is this. I want to understand how I got the beliefs, how I got these results. I want to understand with clarity, like, how did this, how, how did I get a flat tire? Oh, I ran over that thing that says do not back up. <laughs> it's okay. So once you become aware and then you understand, which is very powerful, again, asking people very close to you can help you. And if you're not going to be open with those people, then if you're not growing, you are dying. Uh, if you're not learning, you're going backwards. Okay? Yes? What were your three um, inventory with your wife? Uh, the inventory is like, okay, what am I, uh, what am I doing wrong? Well? Okay. What am I not doing that's good in your life? Like, what do you not like that I'm not doing? You have to be so, because that's a hard question to ask if you're prideful. If the walls of like not being open don't work. And at first, my wife is like, no, right. Yeah, you don't, want to, you don't want to know. I do want to know. No, you don't. I do. And she's saying I don't, I don't want to know because her paradigm. She really thinks I am not open to it. But when I'm like, honey, or love, it's love, my wife. Love, what am, I, what am I doing wrong? Please tell me. What am I doing that's not making you happy? After the questions, the two questions about what I'm doing wrong, what I could do better at, and then it's like, What's one thing that I'm doing good that you like? So it's like, what am I doing wrong? What can I do better? What am I doing great? Two questions will help me grow. One will just reaffirm to me that I am doing some good things. And I do a companionship inventory like seven times a week. <laughs> <laughs> it works. It works awesome. Answer your question? Yep. Thank okay, you. brother. Thank you, and I love you, my brother. Okay. The third thing is called modeling. Okay. The third thing is modeling. <laughs> Blue steel. You gotta help me out. Everyone's gonna go ready and modeling. You gotta right. walk down the aisle That's here. That's what I was just gonna say. Please yeah. walk. Oh, I'm just gonna <laughs> here's the thing. But what I mean by modeling, and I have it on here, is to act, take action and mimic. Like literally, like, what is he doing? Now your beliefs might not, might not match his or her beliefs at first. But you associate long enough with them, you find a way to create value for them. You find a way to model what they do. Follow them. Do, it. You, do you think I came out of the room like doing all these crazy things I do up here? Actually, I did. <laughs> <laughs> did you have some money? Oh, let me raise your hand. So, model and copycat. I'm a wannabe and a gonna be and a am be. Literally. <laughs> I'm a wannabe. I am. There's people I'm gonna be like. And I'm gonna be because it's like, well, I will get, and then I am a be. I have to act it today. So, that's the third thing to change. The fourth thing, law of repetition. Law of what? Repetition. Okay, law of repetition. An act or a statement? An act or a what? Statement. And this is what Anne is going to bring you so powerfully tomorrow. Our voice, like 
hearing us say something over again. In fact, I got a question for you guys. How many of you have ever had negative chatter in your life? Raise your hand and say yes. 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 How is that chatter working for you today? Good or bad? Bad. 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 See, some of you are bad. Some of you are good. <laughs> right? The law of repetition works. Right? When I learned how to play the piano, you know, I sat here. I didn't start like, da, 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 da. like it was like, oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. <laughs> Repetition, 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 repetition. Help me out. Repetition, 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 repetition. Right? Repetition. And you do something over. Help me out. Over and over and over and over again. Just kidding. Law of repetition. You get the point? Practice does not make perfect. It makes permanent. So you practice over and over, help me out, and over and over, 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 and over. BS and crap and procrastination and fear. You practice that in your head over and over and over. Guess what the release is going to be? Some deep crap. Yeah, and then it's going to linger. <laughs> You're going to wonder why you can't get a, get a date. So those are the four ways that I...